what is up guys welcome back to the new video i am very excited to have you here in this video we are going to review four pairs of dr martens sandals because i am looking for a nice sandals for hot summer days and you know this is gonna be quick honest review i tried them all on and i'm going to uh, tell you what i think about them how it feels on the foot i am actually looking for sandals which i can walk in uh, for a longer time so i'm not going for some you know uh, high fashion <laughs> whatever so i'm looking for like more compact sandals i am looking for sandals which i can walk in uh, a lot i have actually always problem to find good shoes for summer because uh, in the hot days in summer my feet are really puffy and you know sometimes sweaty and yeah they got always bigger and then they hurt when i walk along for me it's good shoes important and i have never ever tried uh, dr martin's uh, before so this is uh, my first time because yeah i was like let me get some real shoes for the summer also guys if you are new here to my channel i will very appreciate if you subscribe hit the thumbs up that will really help the video grow and yeah let's just do that i guess So I think I'm actually going to start with my favorites and that are the Clarissa 2 Squad. That's this one. I must say they are pretty heavy. <laughs> they are pretty heavy but I like how they are holding my foot. So my foot is very secure. You got the three straps here and the one you know around the ankle. Here is the other one and yeah i was trying it on you can also see it um, i will show you that somewhere here uh, you have in the back here back of the shoe this uh, logo which is nice i like also you know they are typical uh, made with the, the yellow how is it called you know what i mean they are just made like that but i like this uh, leather this leather is more rough than the other ones which i will show you and these are very really my favorites i like how they look and i think i could uh, walk in those like for hours i hope <laughs> because when not it's pretty useful to buy those right yeah i have the size 38 if you are wondering i don't know i think you don't care the shoes are also pretty pricey as you might know so the clarissa 2 squad they are 169 euros i have here also pretty similar ones which i want to compare them with and that's the grip home quad how i should pronounce it i don't know the grip home quad whatever <laughs> Uh, is this one as you can see it's a little different i have small feet but a little bit wider and this part was a little bit uh, tighter for me i think it would lose because it's leather so you know you have to wear it a little bit so i think it was it would lose the comparison like that so this one is much bigger the weight is almost the same these shoes are really heavy i like much more this one because of the support and i like much more how they look actually on the foot this one was actually bordering me here um behind because i feel like it it felt like too small for my foot i'm not sure why here is also the second one i like also they have the detail on the clips uh, you know the logo dr martens like that they are from the bottoms clarissa 2 squad were also like that from the bottom i'm like really curious how much they weigh i'm gonna literally weigh the shoe so the one shoe literally weighed almost uh, 800 grams it's a lot or i think it's a lot but they are still my favorite i will show you the next two which i have here and i think i will compare these two together because they are like a little bit uh, similar but not i will start with these with this huge platform these are the uh, dr martens was two these are also heavy but not that that heavy i would say and the platform is huge 
think it's like 10 centimeters but these are i would say these are so comfy these are the most comfortable from those which i have here but just the platform is uh, actually a lot like if i would want to wear them you know just like in the city or stuff like that it's good but i am looking for some sandals which i can take a little bit you know maybe some little hikes if needed i'm not sure but in those i cannot hide they are 131 euro 50 cents the leather is not that rough and also the inside is a little bit different i'm not sure if you can tell if you can see it but i really like them how they looked on they fitted me very good because they are not so tight they are pretty wide for your foot you can of course adjust it here so my least favorites are these nartilla they were 119 euros and these are these are light these are pretty light um you have here these uh, straps which you can you know put around your ankle but uh, honestly it was hurting me when i was walking it was scratching my foot and i feel like my foot looked like this uh roasted meat they looked so puffy in those shoes i didn't like those they have also in the back uh you know the logo and this is how they are from the bottoms they are a bit different from the bottoms if you wanna compare them with the, the was two quad so this is the was this is the nartilla and it looks like this I prefer the with the huge platform, the ones actually. So this is pretty interesting. Dr. Martens origin day to 1945 when Dr. Klaus Martens, a 25 year old soldier and medical doctor at the time, created a unique air cushion sole rather than the traditional hard leather sole to aid his recovery from a broken foot. Dr. Martens made a prototype shoe and showed it to a friend and engineer, Dr. Herbert Funk. The two went into partnership and by 1947 they began formal production of their unique shoe. Within a decade they had a booming business. Sales had a significantly grown so much that they opened a factory in Munich. So yeah, behind these boots is really history. You can check this uh, cell. I will link it um, everything below. I'm not sure actually how is it the shipping to Germany from the original website. I bought these shoes by ASOS which is convenient here for uh, Germany. Alright guys I think that's it for today if you have any questions just comment below I will try to answer that don't forget to hit the thumbs up it will really help the video and also don't forget to subscribe that will help my channel grow faster I will see you next time bye bye